Good morning to all. I want to wish you all a very merry everything, no matter what it is you are celebrating on this cozy Sunday. I hope you are celebrating it with people you love and everyone is staying safe and healthy. Today's Sunday Cozies video is going to be a very quick one. I just wanted to check in and let you all know I was thinking about you and just show you a few of the things that have been going on at the house these last few days as we have been very busy getting ready for the holiday. That means going to see Christmas lights. It means getting those Christmas cards together. These ones are my favorite with the little sparkly squirrels all over them. We didn't do family cards this year. These are just some of the ones that I gave along with some gifts that we did this year. I put gift cards and things in them. But I have gathered up all of the ones that we have received and I put them in the little vintage ceramic Christmas tree card holder. They look super cute in there and I've appreciated all of the ones that I've received. Other than that, we have all of the lights on at the house. We have all of the decorations up. There is just one more little activity I decided to do, and that is put together this little tablescape for our kitchen table. I bought some of that fake snow at the Animal Thrift a couple weeks ago. I think I spent 99 cents on it. I just went ahead and added it to a thrifted jar that I found, and I had a handful of vintage ornaments that I had not hung up yet. I think I ran out of hooks. And so I decided I would just be adding those into the jar. These are some really cool vintage ones. I love the little old fruit and pine cone pieces. So what I did was I just put some of the fake snow in the jar. And then I just took the little tiny ornaments that I had left over and I added them inside. So the nice thing is the snow gives it a little bit of cushioning in the jar and it also adds a little bit of glitter and because I didn't need that much from this bag to do this activity I also just sprinkled it around the rest of the tablescape so you can see how cute they look in there it's kind of like a little snow globe although I won't be shaking it and it's just a great way to keep those safe and displayed so they don't get left out this holiday season these are all just little ornaments I have picked up over the years thrifting. Um, some of the indent, there's a cute little moon in there, a little fruit basket, a little peach. They're just really random. So I closed that up. I went ahead and added just some fresh pine and some more of the fake snow to the rest of the tray. Those are my little vintage Santa winking mugs. And lucky for everyone in the house, I did use the last of the snow because it is kind of messy, but I figure it's just once a year when it's like 110 degrees this summer, I'll be thinking about this fake snow and how much fun it was. But then I just went ahead and added some of my other old ornaments into the display and it looks super cute. This week for thrifting, I did find for $5 this little old set of Christmas lights. These are the ice lights that look like they are sugared. All of them worked but one. I got these for $5 for the set. And you can see how charming they look all lit up. They've got kind of that icy look on them. And I also wanted to remind you guys, if you are in the spirit of Christmas, I did post a video of the folks house, my parents house. They have it all decked out for the holiday season. They have the most incredible vintage Christmas displays in their house. Here are some clips from that video, but if you missed it, make sure you go back and check it out. I think it's about two videos back. But it is just a wonderful walking tour of the house. You guys can see all the things that they have used to decorate with this holiday season. Like I said, everything is vintage. Most of it is just auctions, thrifted, garage sales, things like that that they have collected over the years. And it is quite a beautiful display. So I want to make sure you guys don't miss that. Other than that, I hope everyone is having the most wonderful holiday weekend. We are just doing a few more little family visits around here. We started celebrating with family last week, so we are just about at the end of our visits. I do plan on leaving my decorations up probably for at least another week or so 
it's just entirely too cozy. The kids love it, the dogs love it, and I love it. And it's a lot of work putting it out, so I want to get every little bit of joy I can out of it. So, that said, I hope you guys have a wonderful weekend. I look forward to seeing you back here next week. Until then, marry everything. I hope you are with the people that you love, doing the things that you love today. And I hope it's been an absolutely wonderful holiday for you. Until we talk again, happy thrifting.